Everyone, I just returned from watching Ant-Man tonight, Thursday night, before its actual Friday night release. I watched it at Tinseltown 17 here in Fayetteville, Georgia, where Ant-Man was made. Much of the principal photography was done here at Pinewood Studios, Atlanta, Fayetteville, Georgia. My review of the film? Outstanding. I loved it. And viewers of my channel here on YouTube will remember that I interviewed last week at Comic-Con Christoph Beck, the composer of the music for Ant-Man, and one of the questions I asked him was, how do you make music for someone who is going to shrink? And he says, that's really not the story of the film. Ant-Man is really a, a person who is such that heroes don't come any bigger. And with that in mind, the music is almost more like a secret agent-y, James Bondy kind of feel to it as opposed to this let's get small kind of expression. It moves the movie along very well and the movie itself takes you to places that you've never been before. What I love about Ant-Man is how the special effects are so good you are seamlessly taken from the normal size world into a small world and into at least a couple of instances a, a microscopic subatomic world. It's really that good and you don't have a feeling of getting dizzy or losing yourself in the story with these transitions. You really have to see the film to appreciate what I'm talking about. And the other aspect of the movie I enjoyed was how a person's description of what other people said was put into a crosscut with different characters mouthing different parts of the words that, that the main character was saying. And you'll probably say, what? See the movie and you'll know exactly what I'm talking about. I love the way it flows as a flick. I love the mechanism of film that went into how Ant-Man was put together. And I love the acting. Paul Rudd as Scott Lang Ant-Man was excellent. Michael Douglas, wow, an excellent role, his first in the Marvel Universe, and you really believe he is Dr. Hank Pym, and my favorite, Evang the lovely Evangeline Lilly, who I had the pleasure of meeting last year at Comic-Con, was outstanding as Hank Pym's daughter, Hope Van Dyne, and who is going to be the Wasp. But I, the other part of Ant-Man I love was the fight scene between Anthony Mackie Falcon, who is Captain America's buddy, and Scott Lang, when he's just learning to use the Iron... The, excuse me, the Iron Man. When he's just learning to use the Ant-Man suit. And that was really cool, because it was kind of not fair, because Falcon had no idea what he was up against. It was just sort of out of the blue. It was like, hey, where's this guy coming from, right? You know, I, I, I don't have to stop this person, but I don't quite know what this person can do. And oh my god, he's turning small, and he's turning big, and he's hitting me, and he's behind me, and all this stuff you got to see the film. Would I, would I see it again? Yes, I would. But what topped it off for me, in particular, was my time meeting and interviewing the mayor of Fayetteville, Georgia, and members of the Fayetteville, Georgia City Council, who happened to be in the movie right after. So what you're about to see, first of all, are rolling credits where we all applaud about the point where Fayetteville, Georgia appears in the credits, and then I interview the mayor of Fayetteville and the members of the Fayetteville City Council right here. <laughs> The mayor of Fayetteville, Georgia, introduce uh, yourself right, and everyone else. Up. Mayor Fayetteville here, Mickey Edwards, Councilman, Scott, Ed uh, Scott Stacey, Councilman, and uh, Paul Otto, Councilman. I want you from all. From the city of Fayetteville. What do you think about 
the At Men premiere here, and I know I'm very proud that you all got this studio and your words. Well, we, we're else, very yeah. proud too, and we're totally pumped. This it was a oh, great yeah. movie, way better than I anticipated it would have been when I first heard about Ant Man. I thought, yeah, but it was great. It was family friendly. It had good morals. It was a good action. And, you know, it wasn't a whole lot of gore and all that stuff. It was just a really good movie. Council members? Oh, yeah. absolutely. I got to agree. It it's was unanimous. a fun, fun yeah. movie. Yeah, I, it's a unanimous decision, I, I think. And I'll get you two good head. Popcorn, one man. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's the first time I heard of Ant-Man, you know, but I was very pleasantly surprised. How is I this? want to come back for the next one. Oh, yeah, it's oh, going to yeah. be great, oh, isn't absolutely. it? absolutely. How has this changed Fayetteville? And, I mean, it's put you all on the map, and I saw the credits coming up and everything. And, and I'm, I'm from Oakland. I'm pumped. So, you know, what's... How well, this change this? It, it hasn't changed us hardly at all, except in a huge way. <laughs> <laughs> You're the rock stars now, right? Just, just a little bit. And the role was you had as, a... I'm sorry, go ahead. As I like to tell folks, it was the center of the universe, the mm-hmm. film universe. Mm-hmm. And we're getting there. And you had a great economic development program to really encourage the construction of the studio, right? Yes. Yeah. Can you tell our viewers about that? Uh, well, uh, all the stars aligned, and mm-hmm. everything came together perfectly. Uh, the people, the money, the opportunity, the film credit that uh, Georgia has, it really attracted things. Uh, Pinewood had been looking in the United States for 10 years uh, before they decided on a federal site. And uh, we're it, and we're just excited. It's uh, great things are happening. Uh, Very positive for the whole community. Yeah, yeah absolutely. Yeah, yeah. And I want to thank, thank you guys for your time, first of all. Oh, and congratulate you. There's going to be more coming. You have uh, Captain America 3 next. This is just the beginning, folks. Congratulations. Oh, and uh, yeah. what would you think, little one? I, I, I didn't see Captain America 2. No, what would you think of this movie? Yeah. Okay. We're being interviewed. <laughs> <laughs> bueno. She's like, bueno. Thank you all so much. Bueno. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Closing, I want to congratulate and thank for his time Greg Clifton, the mayor of Fayetteville, Georgia, and the members of the Fayetteville City Council had the pleasure of meeting as well as Fayetteville's fire chief and their family members. Congratulations to Fayetteville, Georgia. Job well done. A great movie and I can't wait for Captain America 3.